Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? To find the value of x here, let's write this as 2 squared and raised to power x plus here we have 2 raised to power 3 then raised to power x equals to 36. Then from the law of indices, when we have something of the form a raised to power m raised to power m is same thing as a raised to power m n, which can also be written as a raised to power n then raised to power m so it means from here that we can interchange this power here and this will become 2 raised to power x then raised to power 2 plus 2 raised to power x then raised to power 3 which is equals to 36 from here then in the next step we can use a letter to represent 2 raised to power x so let the letter u be equals to 2 raised to power x from here then this becomes u square plus u cube equals to 36 then in the next step we can take 36 here and we have u square minus u cube then minus 36 now equals to 0 and from here we can also write minus 36 as minus 9 minus 27 and this becomes u square plus u cube minus 9 minus 27 now equals to 0 from here then this gives us u square minus here let's still write this as plus u raised to power 3 then here we can write it as 3 square then here we write it as 3 raised to power 3 which is equal to 0 then let's bring the power of 2 together and here we have u square minus 3 square then plus u cube minus 3 cube now equals to 0 and in the next step when we have something of this form that is when we have a square minus b square this is also same thing as a plus b multiplied by a minus b and uh, likewise when we have difference of two cube when we have a cube then minus b cube this will give us a minus b then multiply by a square plus a b then plus b square which is now what we have here then let's apply here you know we have u plus 3 now then times u minus 3 then plus here becomes u minus 3 then into bracket u square plus 3u then plus 3 square which is equal to 0 so we apply this to what we have then in the next step we have u minus 3 here is common so let's factor it out then this becomes u minus 3 will come out then what we have inside is u plus 3 then what we left here is plus u square plus 3u plus 3 square then equals to 0 and from here we have next u minus 3 into bracket here we can bring u square first then plus here u plus 3 that's for u then plus 
Here we have 3 plus 9. 3 square is 9, then 3 plus 9 equals 12, then equals to 0. So here we have the two possible cases. We have u minus 3 equals to 0, or we have u square plus 4u plus 12 equals to 0. Then here we have u equals to 3. And uh, we are interested in real solution, real number solution from here. So let's check if this will give us a real solution with the determinant, which is b square minus 4ac. And uh, b here is 4, so we have 4 square minus 4. a here is 1. And c here is 12. So this is 16 minus. Here give us 40. And that's giving us minus 32, which is, you know, less than 0. And uh, from here, we see that there is no resolution on this side. So no resolution here. Then we move to this side where u equals to 3. Here, let's recall that we represented u to be 2 raised to power x. So it means that 2 raised to power x now is then equals to 3. Then we can take the log on both sides and then we have log 2 raised to power x now equals to log 3. Then from the power law of log logarithm, we take x to the back here. Then this becomes x log 2 then equals to log 3. And here we divide both sides by log 2. And the log 2 we cancel out from here. Then remain x, which is equals to log 3 over log 2. And uh, to get the you know decimal number solution of this, that is, we can substitute the value of log 3, which is 0 0.4. 771 then over log 2 of that which is 0 0.301 so when we divide this now this gives us x to be equals to 1.585 so here we have the value of x from this problem to be 1.58 to check if this satisfies the given problem from what we have which is 4 raised to power x then plus 8 raised to power x equals to 36 now let's substitute a the value of x so we have 4 raised to power 1.585 then plus 8 raised to power 1.585 with this be equals to 36 from here, then when we check the value of this on calculator, this gives us 9.000. Then plus here, this gives us 27.002. Then if this equals to 36 from here, and this gives us the addition of this, we have 36.002. And uh, this is approximately equals to 36. And uh, this is 36 now, approximately, which is equals to 36. So we have the left hand side equals to the right hand side. And from here, we conclude that the solution to this problem is x equals to 1.585. That's approximately the solution to this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos and turn on the notification bell. Share this video. Give it a thumbs up. Put your comment in the comment section. Thank you. And see you next class. Bye for now.